isn't it weird to um, create videos and post them? I find it so weird. But I really appreciate that she clicked on the play button. <laughs> it's true that it's weird. Why should you listen to me, honestly? But I'm going to tell you all about that in this video. So I'm really grateful that you clicked on that play button to listen to this random Saria girl who just wants to connect with you and talk to you and listen to you and be there for you. So I started this project a little over a month ago and I haven't posted or shared anything since. I started off strong and... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I know, it's really hard to shoot videos in this house. So basically, um, what was I saying? Yeah, that I've been hiding for over a month now because the truth is, is super simple. I was afraid. I was afraid of what? I was afraid of judgment. I was afraid of um, putting myself out there. And basically that fear has been the fear that drove me most of my life and i would say around five years ago i embarked on this um personal journey uh personal development and self-discovery journey that really transformed who i am and um, transformed my outlook on life itself so i would say that this project that is now called officially, well, not really officially, but it will become official soon. Talk to Saria is the fruit of all of my effort and time and energy put into discovering why I was suffering, why I was suffering. And um, I was completely in a blur and I felt stuck. I knew that I wanted to move forward. I knew that I got all the tools. Well, no, I didn't have the tools yet, but I knew that I had the potential to truly live a beautiful life. And I wasn't being myself. I wasn't allowing myself to come through. So for sure, I still have um, challenges every day. I still have, you know, comfort zones that I want to break through. Of course, I'm human and we're all human and we all deal with um, different things in a different way and honestly I'm not here to tell you I have a solution I have the answers I have a magic recipe or formula or I'm not here to tell you how to live your life I'm only here to share one message and this message is that we are meant to burn as bright as the Sun as unique as we are and to live a life of choice is to choose ourselves, to choose who we truly are. And that is not always clear and it's not, it's not always easy. So I'm really here to spread that positive message. I want to um, apply what I've been learning and that I'm still learning. So I think it's also part of my journey to go through all of that because I've always wanted to um, connect people together. I've always wanted to be there for others and to speak out and to express myself. You know, full blown self-expression has always been something that I wanted to empower others to do. And I never truly felt worthy enough to do it for myself. So through this project, I wanna apply, as I said, everything I've been learning. I want to get out of my comfort zone. I want to create a space where we can share, that we can connect, that you know we feel so safe and free to truly be ourselves and to ask questions. And if I don't have the answer, we will figure it out together. We will have, you know, we are we have now with the internet so many different um, opportunities and tools to um, to search. And honestly, it doesn't. The magic doesn't happen all on internet. It happens all around us every day in our lives and those little actions that we take and the choices we make. And when we are aligned with who we truly are, our essence. And also, by the way, I will be using different terms um, that probably have different defini definitions for you. So I will also create content as I go along with this 
beautiful project of mine, Talk to Saria. Um, I will be explaining myself more in depth, but for now I'm just like throwing out words that, I, that probably mean nothing or mean something or uh, basically what I'm saying is that um, I will try to keep it short, but sometimes I get carried away because I'm inspired and I just want to be very spontaneous and um, all of my takes are like one shot takes because I feel so awkward to create setups and create scripts. I really just want to be authentic and natural. So it's going to come out like it's going to come out and I will keep trusting that what needs to be delivered will be deliver delivered. And I hope it lands on you the way that I truly feel it in my heart. And I've recently uh, discovered that, you know, you have to use the mind and the heart to elevate yourself. And the mind is not limited to what is going on in here. Oh, I'm giving myself a little head massage. Actually, I just wanted, to have, I just wanted an excuse to fix my hair, but Honestly, um, it's very important to know that the mind is not limited to your head and it's not limited to your brain and it's not limited to this part of the body. The mind is really through all of your cells, through all of your body and your body, your body, your body is just your envelope on this earth and it's just a tool, it's your instrument that you know, your spirit uses to carry on the life that you want to create, that you want to live. So I, I, I want to share all of that knowledge with you because I believe it is so important as a community. And I'm not talking about our community here in Montreal. I'm, I'm expanding it to the community worldwide. And I know that like I'm going all over the place right now and I like I have this huge vision of just the world being connected and right now we have the tendency to disconnect from everything that is outside of ourselves but truly we are all interconnected and once we realize that and we truly live by that the magic starts happening so this is the mission and the goal of talk to Saria I will also create it as I go. I believe that I need to start where I am right now with whatever I've got, with whoever I am right now on this journey. Um, and then the rest will just evolve. So today, Talk to Sarah is about that, but what will it be tomorrow? Let's find out together. So I'm inviting you to join me here on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, whichever platform you, you choose and you prefer. And to not be shy, to message me, write to me. Um, also, if you want to just, instead of typing, you can leave me an audio and I'll also answer your questions, you know, if they're you know, voice clips or I love voice clips, by the way. But uh, if you prefer to just write to me, that's also very fine. I will appreciate so basically, you know, I just, I want us to just shine and let ourselves shine because we all have a voice and we all have value to offer the world. So yeah, that's, that's really what inspires me right now. And um, I believe that if I'm not acting on all of this that's inside that I've been like suppressing, um, I will not truly live my um, authentic self. I will not honor my authentic self. And I want to encourage and inspire others to do so. And if you're already doing that, well, I support you 100% and I still want to connect because I believe that like-minded people, you know, should fusion and work together so that we create a better world. But it all starts with us. It all starts here with our heart, with our mind, with our soul, with our body, and to just, you know, tap into that potential and expanding because we are on earth to expand. We are on earth to evolve, to grow, to share, to connect. And um, I didn't always think that way.
I'm probably gonna cut that part out.